Welcome to Buy Spares. This video will show you how to change the belt in a condenser tumble dryer. Before replacing a part in any electrical appliance, you must ensure that the appliance is first unplugged from the mains. If you can hear the motor in your condenser dryer working but the drum isn't turning, the problem is likely to be caused by a worn or broken belt. The belt goes round the outside of the drum and around the motor, so that as the motor spins, the drum turns with it. To access the belt and motor, start by removing the top and side panels from the appliance. Remove any struts or mounting brackets from the top of the machine. Unscrew and remove the condenser reservoir and tray. You'll also need to unclip and disconnect the hoses. Remove the impeller cover and impeller. Next, unclip or remove the spring holding the motor in place to release the tension on the motor. The motor can then be rotated to loosen the belt and the belt can slide off the motor spindle and tensioning pulley. Now assess whether it's easier to unscrew and loosen the front or back panel from the dryer and this varies between models. If you are loosening the back panel, remove the heater cover and rear impeller before loosening the panel. You may also need to release any attached cables that prevent movement. Gently part the front or back from the drum and remove the belt. Fit the new belt around the drum, then reattach the mounting brackets, reservoir housing and hoses. Tighten and reattach any screws on the panel so it's firmly fixed in place and reattach any cables previously disconnected. Place the other end of the belt around the motor spindle and tensioning pulley and reconnect the motor to the spring so that it's tense. Reattach the impeller and impeller cover. Attach the heater cover and rear impeller to the back panel if removed previously. Gently rotate the drum by hand to ensure the belt is correctly located on the pulley and there is nothing catching as it turns. Finally, reattach the top and side panels to the appliance. For all the spares you need, visit www.buyspares.co.uk